A house fire early this morning in central Illinois destroyed a home and two cars. It happened outside of Thomasboro on a county road. When firefighters got to the scene, all that was left were small flames and smoking bricks. WCI3's Jack Crum is with us in studio. Jack, was anyone hurt? Karina, thankfully the homeowner was in Urbana and wasn't near the, the house. The fire chief who responded told me that this could have been a tragic situation if someone had been home. If there had been, you know, there would have been no hope for them at that time, so. Overnight flames reduced a house east of Thomasboro to a smoldering rubble. First responders were called to the scene at 2.30 this morning after an Ameren IP worker spotted the burning house after responding to an outage. It was burnt to the ground when we got here. Uh, the fire was burning around the foundation and, and what debris had fallen into the basement, that was, that was burning. So it was basically burning from one end to the other. There was a car in the driveway uh, and it, it was uh, on fire as well. Paul Cundiff is the Thomasboro fire chief. He says the fire burned hot and quietly. The only strange thing is the fact that it had such a head start on us. Um, it's in a remote area, not a heavily traveled, you know, one, two, three o'clock in the morning. Uh, not a lot of traffic out here for somebody to see it. We get a lot of calls off the interstate when close cars or uh, buildings are closer to that. Um, people are going by there all the time, but out here in the country like this, there's not a lot of traffic. So, The fire marshal and sheriff are investigating the fire. Chief Cundiff says finding answers will be hard to do. It's very difficult to pinpoint the, the, the area of the origin and uh, what actually caused the fire. It's very difficult to do that because you just got a pile of debris in the basement now. The fire marshal and sheriff have already talked to the homeowner and nearby neighbors to try and figure out the origin of the fire. People in the area can expect some smoldering smoke to continue for the next couple days.